Can you imagine walking or maybe reaching into an organized closet and having no problem picking out the perfect outfit? Well, how about getting out the door without having to search for your keys? Never happens well for me. That is the passion of the Bare Minimalist, helping people create organized and stylish spaces that make you feel like you've got it all together. And with all the gifts you got for Christmas, maybe now is a great time to declutter. So joining me now this morning is residential organizer Mariah Bear to walk through some of the commonly cluttered areas inside the home and also how you can get rid of any excess, donate and do good. That's a lot you're doing. It is. That it is, is <laughs> awesome. Let's start on this end. And I like the fact that you're not only decluttering, but you're helping an organization and they in turn are kind of helping you too. Yes, I think it helps people get rid of things a little bit easier if they know exactly where it's going and that right. it can help somebody in the community. Let's start over here. What do we have? Wonderful. So Outreach Indiana helps uh, youth and homeless young adults. And so they have shower facilities at their centers and they will gladly take any of these travel size toiletries off your hands. Um, every kiddo that comes in, they will give uh, a kit to utilize um, both in the facility and outside. Yeah, because sometimes you also get a lot of extra of those things during Christmas you time. Sure you sure do. And what's that? So then we have Helping Veterans and Friends, HVAF, and they have a great need for winter gear. They serve the homeless veteran population here in Indianapolis. They also have a pantry where people can come in and get canned food and things like that. So noodles, soups, pastas, things like that will go a very, very long way to support that organization. And Mariah, we talked about people, of course, and a lot of this about that, but yes. it's also about pets, too. It is, it is. So as you're decluttering your linen closets, if you have blankets or flat sheets specifically that are free of holes and the stuffing isn't falling out, Indie Animal Care Services, they support about 14,000 animals every year, and they will line the kennels with the blankets and the, oh, the sheets. Oh, that's awesome. Yes. Makes it feel yes. even more homey. I know a lot of people have so many different Christmas ornaments. Maybe yes. they even get extras. Yes. And sometimes if you have too many extras, it's difficult to get rid of them. It is, and it's really hard in January to get rid of Christmas or holiday decor. But Mars Hill Art Center, which supports the Mars Hill neighborhood, has a blessing closet, and they will gladly take any Christmas or holiday decor off your hands, store it, and then provide it for families in need before the holidays next year. Oh, that's perfect. Yes. Fire truck, what are we talking about? Yes, yeah, so we're talking about Project Play, and they support kids in the community who may not have access to age-appropriate toys. Um, so any books or toy donations that you have, maybe you're cycling out some of the toys that you um, no longer play with to make room for the new, the other amazing thing about Project Play is you can actually schedule a pickup from your home. So oh, really? they make the donation process Even very less work. easy. All yes. right, you showed us an entire table, but this is only a fraction of what you guys have. And I think that this speaks to that, right? Yes. So we have a donation guide on our website um, that has about 40 organizations across the city. And if anyone knows of anything that's missing, I love to keep adding to that and make sure it's really up to date. So. This is a wonderful way to make space in your home and fill it with things you love while also benefiting the community. Donate and declutter. Mariah, you did a great job. Thank you. Thanks for being here. We do appreciate it. By the way, if you missed any of that and what she talked about, we're going to have a link to the Bare Minimalist website. Good name, by the way. Thank you. As more and more information for this story appears, it's going to be posted on our website, fox59.com. I know, Amber, I could use a lot of this stuff because declutter, that's pretty much what I need to do at my house.